hello everyone welcome back in the previous video we successfully are able to edit our customer in the zoho in in our admin area and then we are going to submit this and we are getting this id right so now that i need to update this in the zoho so how to do this so let's go to the documentation and get the update url so url would be this one and remember that this would be a put request right so here you need to type uh, response so let me make this response and i'm not going to save this into a response i'm going to make this http and here i'm going to call the put method because we are updating something in our restful api so this put is responsible for updating stuff so what we want to update we want to update which param so we want to update uh, update where we want to update so we want to update this in our customer right which customer we want to update we want to update this customer we are grabbing its customer id and then here we need to define the updated values so go here and over here we need to type the request and then get the request to name which we are getting from the edit form and then we need to make this uh, oops not this one why it's going to the top so here i'm going to add this in email and also make this an email so we are sending a put request according to this uh, customer and then updating them and then after update i'm going to return this back so let me copy this return back statement i'm very handy i'm not going to write any single line so save this one and then after this i'm going to redirect our user so let's go back and uh, type some name some name so uh, you can name this john doy and then john at the rate of gmail.hotmail.com and update it so i clicked on update and wait for a moment that what's going to happen so if there is any error no there is no error and uh, yes and uh, this customer is uh, not updated what's the hell why it's not updated so let's give it a refresh and check that uh, and yes this customer is not updated so why so let's go to the documentation and check that we are entering this in the right way so this one is a custom oh why because i forgot to add the header so let me attach with this headers here attach headers and then i need to copy this access token here and now it's going to update us so let's go here i'm going to edit this one <laughs> wait for a moment so here i'm going to again make this john doy and john it would be a john at the rate of hotmail click on this update and wait for a moment and check that is there any error or our customer is updating or not so it's redirected back and and, and yes our customer is updated successfully so we uh, first we forgot to add the headers and now we added the headers and this uh, authorized that uh, we are the we are the login user that want to update our customer so now it's successfully updated so hope you are learning a lot from this series so i will meet you in the next one so be sure to subscribe the youtube channel bye bye